a total of $500,000 has been committed towards the construction of the community hall. The Ochozonjupa governor says the community hall will serve as an inspiration for skilled youth to start setting up businesses of their own support in the community. I'm calling upon those serious youth. The doors of our office is open. If you are having a proposal, bring it so that we can see what we can do. Now this noble infrastructure investment was necessitated by the dire situation of the Kalkfeld community who had endured the rays of the sun and blowing winds whenever they held community meeting to discuss socio-economic and other matters of their community. Klassen also inspected government-funded projects such as the sewage network and system, the rehabilitation of the pump station, oxidation ponds and the construction of ablution facilities. The concern I'm having and also the the officials here, this is not fenced around. Anybody can get access to it. That's why when I'm back in the office in Vanduk, I'm going to take it up because I understand they already applied for assistance, how we can fence this thing. And I will make it one of my priorities now since I was here to see that we fence off this for safety reasons. Klassen, however, applauded the Shack Dwellers Federation for continuing to provide adequate and affordable housing to low-income groups, which he says uplifts the rural communities. Faith Sankwasa, NBC News, Oshiwarongo.